Hey everyone, Zelda here. Sorry for the slight delay getting this video out. We've been so busy with bookings at traditional fairground and didn't realise that it would be that way. Events definitely look like they're well and truly back to normal now, thankfully, so I'm definitely not complaining. Anyway, as promised, here is a viewing of our Oliver Wales 24 winning Cups game. As many of you know, it's a typical all win and being Ollie Wales of red car, they're quite collectible. Having said that, we've not seen another one with this back flash on, so quite interesting. So, <clears throat> due to the weight of the front of the machine, I've got Chris to open it already. Here you can see the inner workings. We've had to place a little door stop under it, as when Chris places the coin in at the front, the ball bearing doesn't reach the flicker. So if you're wondering why there's a door stop there, that's the reason. As Chris is demonstrating here, the coin chamber is full, so those pennies are just flying out onto the carpet. Normally, they'd simply fall into the pay box. It's a lovely smooth machine, as you can see the way it moves about. I know Chris has used a few bits and tweaked it. And it's obviously been renovated at some point because there's lots of new like plates on it and so forth. Here's the front again. And as you can see, it's a front opening pay box. Yeah, you must all know by now if you're a regular subscriber, they're the ones to have if you're running or thinking of opening an old penny arcade. You can just see how heavy that door is. I'm just going to move the centre door stop now. Anyway, here's Chris. He's going to open the coin box. There is no tin in there. So we would just swipe the coins out. Um, here we go. Like I said, the actual box is lovely and solid. The wood's really nice. And uh, as you can see, we've got a few pennies in there. We probably could do with getting a metal one in, but when we were working it, there was no real point because we just shovel it out with our hands. Front openers, they're the way forward. I'll let Chris deal with that and show you the 24, the lucky 24 cup flash, along with the side one, stating it was an Oliver Wells of Red Car. But this is what I'm really interested in. It says v pain here, and I want to know a bit more about that. We obviously have the test your skills shoot bit here, and then over to this side, after win, turn the knob. And everybody knows my gripe. Nobody ever turns that knob. I really don't think they ever read that sign. <laughs> I know I've said it before. I've said it all the time. <laughs> anyway, Chris showing us how it's done. Flick the ball bearing and see if it lands in a cup, which it has. He turns the knob because he's read the sign. And here's the payment. These machines, as wonderful as they are, because of the 24 cups, they pay out a lot of money. Um, I would say they're not they're brilliant because they're beautiful and bright to have on a penny arcade but they do pay out loads anyway off that gripe i'm going to take you to the side here not a lot to see other than mounting um, hooks but i do want to find out a bit more about this v pain if you know anything about it do let us know in the comment section please well i hope you enjoyed the video and i'll see you next time bye